Everybody wants to be doichik as our kites. We want our children to be perfect tzaddikim. We just want the fruit. We don't want to have to deal with the stuff before to get there. That's called the tree. That's the fruit. The Barshal didn't make the world in such a way. Tama is Ketama Pri means that you have to know that struggle that he had during the years of eights of the tree is as choshev and as beautiful and as deep and as amazing and it's all part of what? The Tama Pri. It's what led to the Tama Pri. It's what leads to the taste of the fruit. And that's the simple that comes after Rosh Hashanah Kippur when it comes to Sukkot, which is Chag Ha'osif, because the Chag Ha'osif means an ingathering of all the experiences of life. Because I'll say, the Esrug is called Priyat Sadar. Za'avram shahadri ha'kadosh baruch b'seyvet ha'vish nema v'avram zokin b'abi yomim v'ksi v'hadarte b'nei zokin. And the only fruit that we know, the only fruit that we have the Tam eats is what? Is Ketam HaPri, which fruit? Is the Esrug. So Avram Avinu is called, is called Priyat Sadar v'hadarte b'nei zokin v'avram zokin. What's a zokin? An old person's zokin is, has all of life's experiences. And the Gemara says to honor even, even a guy that says zokin, right? Because why? Because because of what he went through in life, he stand up also on the bus for such a person. So Avram Avinu is zokin b'abiyam. He's compared to an esri. The beauty of the esri is it creates harder that it lives through all like it's dar ilano. The Gemara says over there it lives through all the seasons. Tama esri ketama pri. It goes through the winter, goes through the fall, goes through the summer. It's an esri. And the beauty of the esri is the bumps that it has. And by the esri is the tama es. In other words, all the it's not just when it finally became the beautiful esrog. It means all of the years what it went through to become an esrog. And what makes the esrog more beautiful is the fact that it has bumps along the way. And a smooth esrog is not a good esrog. It creates other with the bumps. With all the things that it went through to become an esrog. It's Darab it went through winters. It's not just the summer fruit. It went through winters and spring and fall. and the, It went through everything. Mitchilosov had sorry for the esrog. And therefore, Avram is compared to an esrog. Priyat Hadar, because that's the tikkun of the Eitzadas Tayvara, because the Eitzadas is what Tayvara is the chait of the Adam of Adam, which is that the that the way of getting someplace is not chashiv; it's only when you get there. That's the chait. The tikkun of that is no. The way to get someplace. That's what Baruch created us to have free choice. It is as chashiv; it is as beautiful as when you're there. And not to give up. It's the it's the mahalach of getting there. Ben Sholosh and Ben Abayim. It's all one chilas of Adsayfa. That's called Priyat Sadr. That's the, that's the fruit of the of the I, I told that Barcha that you're more qualified to be a Rebbe than, 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 the, than, uh, than anybody else. What you've been going through and you're struggling and you're making yourself into a Ben Tyra and you have a Kupas HaShwatsen, work hard, keep on working hard. Adra, you're going to save many, many, many Jewish boys. You're not going to look down on these kids. You're going to be able to help them. You'll be able to understand them and you're going to be a Gevaldige Rebbe. Just work. Keep on working. You're going to be the best Rebbe. Hashem Baruch made us to be the Rebbe's of the last generation of time. Every parent now, every every one of us is a Rebbe for the end of time. And a Rebbe for the end of time means that we got Kupas HaShuatz. No, no. Everybody's got his Kupas HaShuatz. Our job is to try to, try to get better and, and through what we've learned over the years of Kupas HaShuatz to help our kids and to help our grandchildren to be better and to be Zerchet to to, to be able to greet David Amalek, David Amalek is going to, is going to look at us and he's going to give us a little bit of wink. He says, you got your problems, I got my problems. <laughs> but, but here we are, we made it. With the Gulash of Amitis, I'm heavy on my Thank you for listening to the Guard Your Eyes Daily Chizuk Broadcast. Pass them on to your friends and help spread Kedusha in the world.